This is the weekly weather briefing for Western Washington for Friday, April 19th through Thursday, April 25th. Do not use this briefing after noon on Saturday, April 20th. A transition from rainy weather to sunny, warmer weather will occur next week. The rain Friday will turn to scattered showers over the weekend. A ridge of high pressure will build next week with a warming trend. This chart shows the set of solutions for the 850 millibar level temperature through the next two weeks. This is from the German Weather Central website. After a uh, quick dip in the temperatures aloft through the 21st, uh, there's uh, nearly all the ensemble members show a warming trend through next week. And uh, most of the ensemble members show no precipitation. They're just a very few solutions with a few light showers. Uh, so it's likely that uh, high pressure aloft will build into the region next week and that high temperatures across the lowlands of western Washington will warm into the mid and upper 60s with 70s possible if some of these warmer ensemble members turn out to be correct. There's a short sequence of 500 millibar charts. This is the uh, chart for Saturday with heights about 560. This is the chart for next Tuesday, heights rising to 570. You can see a little bit of a warmth coming up the Willamette and into southwest Washington. The upper level ridge is still centered offshore. It'll need to shift east over the area if temperatures are to get really warm. Here's a forecast of sea level pressure for the middle of next week. This is the sort of pattern that starts to give us our normal summer northerly wind, which is good for afternoon sailing. This is the thermal trough. After Cloudy, showery, cool weather over the weekend, there's a good chance that highs will warm well into the 60s and perhaps the 70s next week. The freezing level in the mountains will rise from around pass level over the weekend to around 10,000 feet midweek, and northerly flow will develop as thermally induced low pressure sets up to the south. This weather pattern promises sunshine and warmth the next week. The sun angle is about the same as late August. This warm spell might lure some people to area rivers and lakes. Rivers are running cold and swift and are icy cold. On Friday, state parks and the National Weather Service issued a joint press release urging people to be prepared if enjoying rivers and lakes across the state during warm weather. Wear a life jacket. There's some resources for further information. In particular, you can visit the National Weather Service Seattle website at weather.gov forward slash Seattle. Thanks for viewing the briefing and have a good weekend. Enjoy the warm sunny weather next week.